Hey everybody, uh, apologies it's literally taken forever to uh, put a new video up, as you can see, uh, these go back, right back to June uh, this year, um, to, to be perfectly honest the main reason is I've just kind of slowed right down doing TTMs at the moment, it's just getting too expensive, it's very very hit and miss, uh, so I've started, as you probably know if you've seen my previous videos, collecting uh, signed books, and that seems to be my, uh, <clears throat> my kind of new route at the moment for the most part, um, so Let's jump straight in and have a look what I've received over the course of, uh, well, since the last time I uploaded a video. Okay, so the first um, first pickup was this charity shop purchase uh, by its um, a book, signed book, signed by James Corden. I, I cannot stand James Corden, to be perfectly honest with you. Don't like him as an actor, don't like him as a person at all. Um, <clears throat> but, of course, he was in Doctor Who for a couple of episodes, uh, so needed to add this to the collection. So pick this up. I think this is... You know, like most of the books I pick up around the sort of pound to two pound mark not much more than that uh, nice big autograph here on the front as you can see um, and this is his signed book may I have your attention please signed by James Corden so that's a new one for the Doctor Who collection uh, next up was a TTM. This is uh, from Howie Hammerman, who is or who is one of the um, sound engineers from Return of the Jedi. He 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 provided the burp for Jabba the Hutt for Jabba's burp. Um, there's a great story behind this in that he sent my returns back to me, sent these photos back to me, um, and they got returned to sender back to him. So he went online, found my house on um, Google Earth took some screenshots, wrote me a letter and sent it to me and said, is this still your home? Uh, I want to check because I've got your pictures, blah, blah, blah. Uh, gave me his personal uh, WhatsApp and email address and said, get in touch if this is yours so I can return your pictures to you, which is awesome. So he signed both my pictures. You can see this one here, Howie, Jabba's Burp, and this one here as well. A uh, bit of a random one, I suppose, in the collection, but cool, another new addition to the, uh, to the Star Wars collection, which is pretty cool. Uh, next up is another signed book. Again, a charity shop purchase. This is from Charles Spencer, uh, who's the ninth Earl of Spencer. Uh, he's also the younger bro brother of the um, former Princess of Wales, Princess Diana, R.A.P. Uh, and um, this is his book about the history of the Spencer family. Uh, and I picked this one up. Again, it's signed Charles Spencer, 4th of July, 2001. So um, not not my usual pickup, but because of the link to Princess Diana, I thought it was quite a cool thing. So um, grab that one, as I said, again couple of pounds, two, three pounds, absolute maximum, I would have thought. Uh, next up, another book. This one was literally, I think I paid like 20p for this one. It's Henry Blofeld, who is a journalist and cricket commentator. That's literally, I think this was 20 pence. Uh, I've already got one of his books signed already. But the, this one had the big sticker on the front uh, and nice signature inside from Henry Blofeld. Um, I'm not a massive cricket fan, if I'm totally honest, but signed book and it was 20p so i'm gonna leave it sitting there let's be honest so that's now in the collection as well uh, next up this was a via venue return uh randomly never had anything for james corden bought his book from a charity shop saw he was uh in, at a venue in london so wrote to him and typically got the back signed unfortunately um he signed and put the pictures in the envelope and they stuck to each other made a bit of a mess of the pictures which is a real shame but uh, you know it is what it is um so there's this one and you can see all the white sort of marks where it's stuck to the back of the other photograph it actually makes the the signature look a bit nice a bit clearer um because i sent him stupidly a couple of dark pictures but um you know again it is what it is and this one here with matt smith uh, not the best of signatures if i'm totally honest but i'll add them to the collection all the same happy to to add them uh, next up, uh, this is a really cool charity shop purchase. Uh, this is Heart That Works by Rob Delaney. Really sad story about the loss of his young son. Um, but Rob is probably best known at the moment for appearing in um, Deadpool. So um, I absolutely was going to pick this story up. Probably, probably not the sort of story I'd read. Not really into kind of like sad stories or stories about children dying. A bit sad. But um, this is the only opportunity I would have to get Rob's autograph. So definitely pick this up for a couple of pounds. Uh, and you can see uh, signed by Rob Delaney here. Uh, this is quite a cool return. This is from Kirsten, I can never pronounce his name, Vangsness. I think it's Kirsten Vangsness, who's best known for playing um, Penelope Garcia in Criminal Minds. I wrote to her, as it says here, about three and a half years ago. Uh, and then and then got my pictures back signed, but she put loads of extra stuff in, which is which is brilliant. So she signed tons of stuff. Uh, this is something she included. This wasn't something I sent her. Um, she sent uh, this this signed picture. Uh, she also included uh, this is one of the pictures I sent her, and she's personalised them. Carl Kristen Vanksness as well. Uh, this is one of my pictures uh, that she sent back. 
Uh, this is one that she included. And then she also included a signed page uh, from her script from Criminal Minds as well, which is which is brilliant. So you can see all of her um, uh, sort of text on, on the script there. And she signed the page, Carl, Love and Happy Adventures from Kirsten of Angstner. So amazing. Um, I did actually get a few more pictures back from her as well, but they weren't um, they weren't as good or they didn't photograph particularly well so I left them out I ended up getting about eight or nine things back from her and I only sent her two or three so amazing return and well worth the three and a half years that it took to get it back uh, this is a signed book again I, th I believe this one was 50 pence in a charity shop not a fan of Eamon Holmes he's certainly gone a little bit right wing and off the rails for my liking recently but a um, uh, bit of a conspiracy theory, theory nut and, and what have you but uh, again it's only 50p uh, and as you can see here, signed by Eamon Holmes, he's a TV, a TV presenter, um, he used to be married to Ruth, uh, oh god, what's her name, Ruth something, I can't remember her surname now, um, not anymore, lucky escape for Ruth, um, but yeah, signed 50p, was always going to grab that from the charity shop. Uh, next up was another book. This is a paperback book. I don't see very, very many paperback books signed. Predominantly, it's hardback. Um, but again, this is a great one. Absolutely not passing up this opportunity. It's Warwick Davis. I've got a couple of autographs from Warwick already. Best known for Star Wars, Labyrinth, uh, Willow, that kind of stuff. Um, so I uh, picked this one up. and It's a really nice signature. It, says, it is, it is um, personalized. But it says, enjoy my short story. Uh, from Warwick Davis 2012 so uh, yeah always going to grab that one again probably paid about two pound for it so nowhere nowhere's passing that one up uh, and the last one uh, for this video at least is a signed first edition f uh, book by Greg Hurwitz it's Into the Fire I don't know Greg particularly he's best known for writing the tv series it's I believe it's called Orphan Zero I want to say someone correct me on that um but he's written lots of um comic stories for marvel and dc as well um and is quite a well-known author um found this in the charity shop again i believe this was two pound you see it's a signed copy and it's an exclusive signed first edition as well signed by greg hervitz in february 2020 so uh yeah another nice addition to the signed book collection and that's it for this video hope you enjoyed it um there'll be another one coming out a lot sooner because i've got a lot of stuff to put up on the, the site and record so hopefully you'll see another video from me very soon please do like comment subscribe all that sort of stuff i love to read comments from people so please do it's much appreciated and uh, hopefully you've enjoyed the video and i'll see you again soon take care